Hello and welcome to Jacob Holmes CT5016. Today I'm going to show you Undermined for level design. This is a survival horror game in, played in the first person perspective. The player controls a character who is stranded in a underground base or bunker and has to navigate around while avoiding monsters but they have the ability to throw flares to light up the way. The player has mouse look and WASD for movement controls and this game uses Unity 5's physically based rendering for the shading. This is the hole that the player fell through and the player is also testing throwing the flares which will shortly go out to test functionality. Before now approaching the activate generator sign which will tell them the amount of generators needed to activate the lift to get out of the game. This is a non-hostile monster, they're only there for scene decoration and they're created and sculpted in mud box. The player is now walking to activate one of the first generators. These are collision hit and there's a trigger box. Now throwing players down to see where there's a possible monster, so not to go down there. Pressing V on the keyboard shows the player map where they can access all the territories from and find their way around. The display box clearly shows that one generator has been activated with a flashing light. The player is now activating the second generator. All these modules feature physically based rendering shaders built into Unity and detail maps as well. All sound effects in the Foley were created specifically for this game, as well as the music features in the title screen. There are three types of enemies in the game, Howlers, Movers and Shakers. Howlers are wall-mounted and pose no threat to the player, but are merely an alarming character. Shakers move very slowly and movers move very fast and can chase the player with a wide nav mesh, mesh agent to chase them. These are some easter eggs added in for bonus content. To create an unsettling atmosphere, lights are added, however, occasionally they go out triggered through a JavaScript script, which creates un uneasy tension in the player. When the player enters a dark zone and then proceeds to go out into the hub world, the world will look very light. This is due to the physically based rendering and bloom, creating the illusion that the player has just blinking their eyes in bewilderment, having entered a light zone. The player has now activated the last generator and is on a B line for the lift to activate it. The player now activates the lift to progress to the end of the game. Note that if not all four generators are activated, the lift won't work. Thank you very much for playing Undermined, and I hope this makes a convincing survival horror.